wanted to thank you folks for keeping Aunt Liliana here till I could come. Oh, it's no trouble. You know, I keep thinking, if it wasn't for your daughter... Well, someone was watching over both of them. We're really pretty lucky. Hi, Aunt Liliana. I I'm, I'm really sorry that you're not feeling well. I feel... I feel fine. I, in fact, I could enter the Olympics. Yeah. But uh, you know what, Aunt Liliana? We're, um... We're all kind of afraid that you might harm yourself. Wandering around at night, forgetting where you are, and now leaving the kitchen with the, the stove on? Well, I mean, if you would stop checking on me, <laughs> then you would worry less. In fact, I don't even know what you're doing here. <sighs> Beverly and I, uh, my wife, we talked about having her come live with us, but we can't. You know, we just can't. Uh, Beverly is working crazy hours. I'm putting in 15 hours a day at the, the newspaper. And Aunt Liliana, there'd, there'd be nobody there to watch you. Nobody has to watch me. I'm not a cake in the oven, okay? And you, you know what? I'm sure that there are some nice, very nice places right here in Glenbrook. We could sell your studio. Sell my studio? Why should I sell my studio? All right, fine, fine. You know what? We need to talk about this reasonably. It's time that we talk about a retirement home. A retirement home? Yes, a retirement home. <laughs> I should retire to a retirement home? Please, I mean, it's just ridiculous. There's no need to, there's no need... Okay, fine, fine. That decision is yours. The question is then, Aunt Liliana, do you have another suggestion? Well, I'm not going to be put away. I am not going to be... Be put away as long. Ah, ah. Yeah, I'll get some oh, No one's going to put you away. No one. You can stay here until things settle down. <laughs> 